Welcome to the Mike Palooza Outdoors, a uh, little thing that I got going on here. I've got a day off, which uh, doesn't seem to happen very often right now, which is a good thing. Um, but when I do, I come back and uh, try to get things ready to roll. I got uh, a three-day shoot here where I'm going back up to Sakakawea. But uh, one of the nice things about having a day off is when I get my little one. And actually today, my oldest, Gianna, what are you doing over here, Gianna? Will you tell me what you got going on here? Um, uh, I just unraveled this, so I'm Doing this. So you're putting them on there? Mm -hmm. and, and as you can see, she's uh, putting on uh, some slow death rigs onto my Lindy uh, tackle tamers. Um, I'll tell you what, it's kind of interesting right now out on Lake Sakakawea. I mean, slow death is certainly king. Uh, anything with uh, red, green, or white beads seems to be really good. Uh, moving, you know, 0.8 to a mile an hour. Uh, one of the things, though, we are finding is some of the biggest fish that we've been catching, and maybe this will be a little thing for one of you guys out on the out on the Governor's Cup or the Dakota Water Classic, but it seems like we're uh, we're catching some bigger fish on Lindy rigs with tiny hooks, really light sinkers moving super, super slow. It seems like that's taking some of the biggest fish, so uh, it might be something uh, you might want to give it a try, but you know those fish are ranging anywhere from, you know, they'll be shallow in the morning and they'll slip down into deeper water during the day, uh, regardless of wind, so you got to kind of trust your electronics, which I think is key up there, but uh, again, what do you got going on there, G? What are you unraveling now? Now I'm unraveling this. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, she's definitely got more patience than I do, guys, which is cer certainly nice. I think she's going to make a really good fisherman someday. But uh, I do. I got some kids in the boat again tomorrow, which I absolutely love. Some first-timers. We're going to go out there and see if we can't catch them some fish. But we're going to go out on the eastern edge of Sakakawea tomorrow, which would be in the Governor's Cup boundaries. Uh, we'll stay out of there Friday, Saturday in the tournament. But uh, uh, tomorrow we're definitely going to go in there and see what we can find and just uh, – Try to keep it close and simple and we got like i said i got kids in the boat so that's always fun but until next time like and share this video share it around a little bit let's see if we can't get some more folks in the boat uh nothing better than uh you know getting some first timers in there to catch some walleyes so until next time this is mike blues outdoors thanks for watching